the reason that I wanted to come and teach and do research at a liberal arts college is I really valued the interactions I had with my mentors when I was a student and I knew how important that was for my own development and I wanted to be able to give that back to the next generation of students. I was very fortunate that I had a relationship with a professor who was able to encourage me to get involved in research and also help me find a lab in which I was able to do my research because I don't know that I would have pursued those opportunities on my own without that guidance. One of the great advantages of being at a small liberal arts college is that students really do get to know the faculty. My advice for students is to find a faculty member that they feel comfortable with and seek out that person as a mentor as early as possible in their college career so that they can build a long-term relationship with that person. My research revolves around understanding why some of our genes are only expressed from one of the two copies we inherit from our parents. Almost all of my research students have gone on to pursue advanced degrees. About a third of them have gone on to medical school, about a third of them have gone on to pursue their PhDs in graduate school, and the remaining third have graduated more recently, and most of them are working as research technicians with the goals of going on to medical or graduate school. I truly believe that doing research is one of the most important things that an undergraduate student can do for themselves. It teaches them to think creatively, it teaches them to analyze and interpret information, and it teaches them what doing science is really all about.